Sailing Made Easy with the American Sailing Association. All right, it's time to talk about trim and slot effect, the difference between the jib and the main and how to make them work together to give you the power and trim you need. First thing we're gonna do here is we're gonna pull our cabin top closed so I can work on the deck. Stand up here and now I can move around without falling into the cabin, always an embarrassing thing. I've already got our jib out, we've got the main up as well. Taking a look at this, you can see the jib has got a real nice shape from the way the wind is blowing us right now, creating a differential between one side and the other, which gives us lift in the sail. This sail acts as an accelerator, pushing the air back along the back sail, the back wind side of the main sail. This accelerated air causes even a greater differential in the pressure between the upwind and downwind side of the sail and gives the main more power. That's slot effect. I want to talk a little bit about our telltales up front here. You'll notice these yarns. You've got a red and green yarn, green for starboard, red for port, because red port mm -hmm. wine. As we trim our sails in and out with the sheets, what we're trying to do is get smooth airflow on both sides of the sail. The way we tell that is how these little telltales fly. If they fly parallel to each other, we've got smooth laminar airflow. That's the best power and the best pickup for our sail. These work really well in a close reach down to about a beam reach. Once we start going downwind, that'll be a different trim and we'll talk about that later. But right now, as we're talking about upwind trim, we're keeping an eye on our telltales. The next thing to keep an eye on here are these draft marks, the long blue lines along the sail. By putting these lines in here, the uh, trimmer or the skipper can tell where the bulge of the sail is and adjust accordingly. We always set our jib first, then our main, because the wind flows this direction. If we set the main first and then the jib, we'd have to reset the main. So, keep an eye on your slot, set your jib first when you're going upwind, finish it off with the main, and then you're set to go. Sailing Made Easy, the American Sailing Association textbook. Order your copy today at ASA.com.